Hello students, today we will see 4th standard EVS, 1st chapter, the animal kingdom. We will see the textual exercise part. He is asking here, write the similarities between animals and yourself, he is asking. Similarities means both similar qualities, both experience the world. Means we and the animals experience the world. Both need food, water and air. Both grow and reproduce. These are all the similarities between animals and ourselves. Next, see the picture and observe the differences between you and cow. He is asking. We will write the differences between I and cow. Differences are as follows. I wear clothes. Cow doesn't wear clothes. I have two legs and two hands. Cow has four legs. I can talk. Cow cannot talk. I have hair on my head. Cow has horns on its head. I eat cooked food. Cow eats raw food. I do not have a tail. Cow has a tail. And one more thing, the special quality of the human being is we can smile, but the animals cannot smile. Next one is Name of the animal is given, size, color, foot and dwelling he is asking to write. Now, first animal is cow. Cow, size is big, color white, brown, black, food it is grass, plants. Then dwelling, so, dwelling means place where they, where they live, that is shed, cow lives in shed. Fish, small, multicolored. They eat insects, they live in water. Crane, crane size is small, it is in white color, they eat insects and fish also they eat, they live on trees and in water. Then butterfly, butterfly is a small in size, I mentioned here, is small in size, they are in multi color, they, their food is nectar, they suck the nectar from the flowers, they live on plants. Next animal is monkey. Monkey, big in size, they are brown and grey color. They eat fruits, small insects on the trees. They live on trees. Garden desert. It's a small in size, brown and black in color. They eat insects. Their food is insects. They live on trees. Rabbit. Rabbit is small in size, brown, black and white. We can see all three colors, rabbits. Then they eat grass as well as carrot they like to eat, carrot and radish. They live in fields and forests. Grasshopper, small in size, color, green color. They eat the insects, they live in fields. Chartreuse, small in size, brown in color. Next food is insects. They live on, in water and as well as on land. Bat, bat is small in size. It is Black in color. Next, they eat the insects. They live on trees. Next, fill in the blanks. A few animals like fish live in water. Monkeys, birds and insects live on trees. Many animals like dash and dash live on land. Cow, lion, tiger, buffalo. Any animal that live on land you can mention here. Different animals eat different kinds of food. Based on their food habits, animals are divided into three categories. They are herbivorous animals, carnivorous animals and omnivorous animals. Animals which eat the products of plants such as grass, leaf, etc. are called herbivorous animals. Animals which eat flesh, egg and other products of animals are called carnivorous animals. Animals which eat products of both plant and animals are called omnivorous animals. These are all the three types of animals based on their food habitats. From which animal is the milk used in your house? Got from. We get milk from cow and buffalo. Sometimes we will drink goat milk also and then one more question make a list of the food items used in your house 
draw a circle around the food items obtained from animals. The food items that are used in our house are milk, corn, eggs, wheat, rice, java, fruits, vegetables, oil, ghee. From all these, you can mention any other food items also. But from that, what are all you are getting from animals? You have to circle. Here, I am circling milk and egg. These two are obtained from animals. After that, write five uses of animals. We get milk from animals. We get wool from animals. Animals are used in fields. Animals give us food like meat, egg, etc. Animals are used to carry loads and for transportation. These are all the uses of animals. Any other uses also you can write. Here is a picture given above. You have to write the uses of the animals. How these animals are useful to us. We have to write the space provided for us. Then here this is see birds. Birds how they are useful. They disperse the seeds. Next honeybees gives us honey. Then oxes used in plowing fields. After that horse transportation. It's a cart. We can see jet car from one place to another place. We roam in the jet car. Next, cow gives us milk. After that, fish used as food. Cow gives us milk. Next, sheep gives us wool and meat. Then, dog guards our house. These are all the uses of the animals in this picture. Whatever picture is given us for today, this is a class. Remaining, we will see in the next class.